Hey guys, this is Shoddy here. Welcome to episode 90 of Sit Down with Shoddy. Today I'm playing Judge Amaru Gekka Ma Maiden, Martin. Yeah, there's more to the title, but I could not be stuffed trying to remember and trying to pronounce it all, so. Yeah, Judge Amaru Ma um, Gekka Maiden. But anyway, this is a Famicom game. Um, it's Japanese only to release, I believe. And it's actually an action RPG, or. Yeah, it is technically an action RPG. There's no, like, leveling up as far as I could tell, but, um, everything else there, uh, you could, um, probably just call, be part of, like, a, it's kind of like Zelda, like, uh, probably like the original Zelda. Yeah, it's probably the best comparison I can make, from what I can think of. But, uh, yeah, anyway, uh, I apologise for not releasing any episodes the last couple days. Um, to be honest, my mental health's kind of been fucked up, um, recently, I've kind of had, like, quite a bit of bouts with anxiety, and I've been pretty, pretty depressed. And I've also got into what they call idle hell, which, I'm thinking about starting a, um, vlog series coming up soon. Maybe the next week or so. Maybe even tomorrow if I feel like it, but, uh, yeah, one of the, probably my first topics that actually, I'm actually going to talk about while the story keeps on going here, um, is actually going to be my love for the, uh, Love Life series. And not just the anime, I mean, like, the whole franchise itself, so, be on the lookout for that, because that's a video I really want to do. My vlog series is basically going to be talks that I don't really get to talk about while I'm, you know, doing these episodes or anything, so, you know, stuff like real life. I don't want to bring any, like, politics into it, that's the only thing I want to avoid, but everything else should be fair game. So, uh, yeah, anyway, we just finally started, we just finally got into the game here. Yeah, I can't actually understand any of this text, so, yeah, this was all automated just from the beginning of the game. I played a little bit of this, but I managed to get stuck on a piece of dialogue and I couldn't get out, so, it was before I really discovered any of, like, the action parts or anything, so all that was new to me, but, yeah. And I, even, I don't know if it's just video, but I don't remember stuttering all that much when I was playing this. It seemed, seemed a lot more fluid when I was actually playing it. The music's actually really good as well. I really like the music in this game, so... There's definitely a high point for it. Like... I don't know, just something about the music, it's just really memorable for me. But uh, yeah, at the moment I was talking to these people, just seeing if anything's going to go on, but... I just got this area here, and this is basically the overworld. Yeah, basically, these enemies are all pretty easy at the beginning anyway. Um, sometimes they drop these, um, coins. Because if you see the middle counter there, th those are coins, basically. It took me a bit to figure out, but once I did, it was before I got into any shops or anything, which I eventually do do, but, um, yeah, um, basically, I kind of figured that out once I started cl c um, culminating a lot more. Or accumulating, I should say. But yeah, this is actually a pretty fun game, I would say. Um, the flow is fluent enough. The music's pretty good. The music's great, I would say. Um, I figured out quite a bit of this game on my own, but I did get stuck on one place, and that's why the um, episodes are a little bit shorter than I really wanted to be. Although, as I've said in the past, my limit is basically 10 minutes. If it's over 10 minutes, and I decide to end it, even not just over the 10 minute mark, which is about 12 minutes, so... It definitely fit that bill, then yeah, I count that as an episode, but if it's under 10 minutes, then... I'll most likely either reshoot the episode at a later date, or just can the game altogether. Although, to be fair, this um, whole point in the series is to try and play as many games as I can, so... Yeah, um, and I know I said I was going to be doing handheld games as I go into a new area. I know I, know I said I was going to be doing handheld games for the next two episodes. They're still, they're still there. I, I can still record them and all that. You know, I just got to do the commentary, but I decided, you know, I'll just do a shorter video for now, because it's quite late at night. I mean, it's technically my fault for recording late at night, but, yeah, just a shorter video, because the other two are like 15, 20 minutes long, even longer, I think, in one case. I think one's more like 25 minutes. But, uh, yeah, I figured, you know, I'll just do a shorter video, since I just recorded this today. So I still plan on um, recording another video today, but, or another episode, I'll just say, but I kind of just forgot all about that, to be honest, so. Yeah, basically, I just want to finish this episode off and uh, just watch an anime, really. Keep more of that um, show I was talking about a couple episodes, or last episode, actually. 
but yeah, that that's probably going to be another topic that comes up um, in my vlogs as well as the uh, anime discussions because, well, yeah, I'm a big fan of anime. Anime and music are probably going to be big talking points when it comes to uh, my vlog series. You know, the type of music I've been listening to, the type of anime series I've been watching. Yeah, basically it's stuff like that. But anyway, just get um, back onto the game for a bit. Um, yeah, basically a lot of these enemies, all these enemies are facing during this um, recording either took one or two hits. So yeah, they're not that hard to kill, especially since you can kill them from range. Um, yeah, like you can kill them from range and they don't really take any too many hits and they don't really, they're not really that aggressive or... Well, the enemies so far haven't been aggressive, but I believe there's one enemy that well, I would consider aggressive coming up. But yeah, it's going through this, um, church, temple. But yeah, these bats right here, they can be quite annoying just because they have a quick let it go after you. And sometimes they're spawned just right... Yeah, like, there, I just managed to get hit, and yeah, I got hit twice there. I think they'll never get, 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 like, a triple hit, or a three in a row, but yeah, then I accidentally went out of the, uh, went out of the area, and went back and, uh, spawned right in my standing path, so... And I reached the top here, unfortunately, I don't believe anything was up here. You know, I did, tr I think I did try and check, see if there was any, like, paths, but... No, that seemed to be it. So yeah, I have to go back down and try some of these different areas here. You know, I had to search all the place out, so you know, just in case. And also you do get um health by sometimes when killing enemies, but it seems to be somewhat rare to actually get that as like a drop, I suppose. It doesn't really drop anything onto the ground, but yeah, yeah, like you just saw there, I just managed to get half health back half a heart back. Which is nice. 106 coins. I do actually use them because yeah, I actually do find shops and all that. Thank God. But yeah, I, end, um, I go into this area, the temple, again, or I should say, like this is my new area. But yeah, back at the moment, let's backtrack because I believe I've explored all this area as I could. I don't know if I missed any parts that I just didn't see coming up, or I didn't see when I was going up. If I did, then. Yeah, it probably would have been smart on my end, but yeah, um, yeah, I believe I did everything I could. I made sure to go back up there. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I just, yeah, I remembered where I'd gone down to check up there, and yeah, basically no, there was nothing there. I mean, I did only look for like half a second, but once I saw there was no piles or anything, then I didn't see any points of being there. And yeah, at the moment, I'm just basically killing these in hopes that I get my health back up. I wasn't really killing them for anything else. Because, as I said, you don't level up or anything. It's basically just kill enemies, get coins, get hearts back. And yeah, here's the, uh, here's a little village, which is where the uh, first shops are located. I'm going to go into here. This isn't actually a shop, this is basically a hospital. You have to pay 20 coins to get your health back up to full, which, you know, makes sense. Thankfully, I thankfully I figured that out, because, yeah, as I as saw it seen below, um, I was quite low on health. And, yeah, at the moment, I'm just basically going through these houses, seeing if anything's important. Yep. I, as I said, I can't understand anything, so... There's this little broken down house here that you can't actually go into. Look like you could, but obviously not. But yeah, I'm just making sure at this point, just making sure no important dialogue's being missed. Even though I can't understand it, they'll usually give me like an option or something. But yeah, whatever. Like, it's always good just to make sure. And here's another. I didn't actually check in that house. I probably should have, because why would there be a separate area just over there? But yeah, this is a shop. I don't know what, what I didn't know what all the items were, so I, I just bought this. I believe this might have been. Oh no, I didn't actually buy that. Oh yes, I did. Yes, I did. I don't actually know what that was though. I mean, I bought two white. I bought yeah two items. But I don't know what item was which. 
but uh, yeah, I'm gonna. I, I was trying to press start there, but I couldn't open the menu up during um while I'm in the store or in a building. So, but yeah, I was, I bought some sort of potion that I could not use. I don't know if that was just because I was on full health, but uh, and I also bought a uh, new weapon type, those um the ninja stars. As you see down the bottom, I only get 20 uses of them. I didn't actually realise that when I was... Yeah, as you see, I just indiscriminately shoot one there. I didn't realise I actually had a limit, so... But, you know, probably wasn't the best idea. I'd, I'd assume Ninja Stars actually would have a limit, because... Well, you know, they're pretty much just ammunition. I get stuck on the wall there for a... I get a little bit stuck on the wall. But yeah, as you're going to see here, uh, this is basically poisonous, I believe. And yeah, basically, I just die straight away. Yeah, this is kind of a cool menu, uh, basically it's just this little screen here with an angel coming down, and you get three options, I'm not, I'm assuming the, uh, third option would be to quit the game, or completely, but, um, I'm not sure what the second option would be, but yeah, as you see, I get, um, put all the way back down into the starting city, or the starting village, I should say, and yeah, basically I have to go through this area again. Which, you know, considering I didn't have to kill any of the enemies, I did decide to there for some reason, but... And yeah, I, and I started off with five coins, so... I don't know if I had to pay coins to actually continue, or if it was just you... You start off with five coins, or maybe no coins when you start off, but yeah, I, I accidentally almost went into that area. I do wonder if I had just continued on, if I would be able to... Well, if I'd just been able to, like, continue normally, but I, it didn't look like I could, so... Yeah, so I enter this little cloud area here. Basically, this does nothing. I believe, I believe you have to unlock something to get past these clouds, but I'm not sure what that would be. And yeah, it's around this point where I just decide to go back to the ending area again, or the gated area, just to see. But it's around about this time I decide, you know what, I can't really do anything else without repeating myself. So yeah, I'm going to end the episode here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um pretty good game, especially if you f manage to find, like, if, if there's, like, an English translated version, or this so game somehow was released in America under a different name. I wouldn't think so, but, you know, just on the off chance there is, and, yeah, go play this game, especially if you find a translation of it. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode, guys, and, yeah, hopefully the next episode should be out tomorrow, so I will see you guys then.